This is a brief update on my broken solar tracker 2 axis tracker. I broke the actuator, linear actuator, and now I've got a temporary. But what I did was change from a AC from a DC to an AC system. So how am I making AC out of a solar panel? Okay, follow the little wire straight into the micro inverter and right on out and plugged into my handy dandy little BN Link smart Wi-Fi switch that's a neat switch because it gives you usage data how many amps and watts this thing's used this has to have some sort of signal already on the line for this micro inverter to work whether it's an off-grid inverter already in the house or the grid this will work this will work on 50 hertz 60 hertz 120, 240, 230, any one you want. And it's it's world compatible based on where you live. You just order the one you need. This orange cable is going straight into my house. I'm doing a test today of the vertical panel there. It's plugged in on the same type of setup to measure the difference in the solar production when I mounted this gizmo had the panel sitting flat with the ground on the panel and it, the angle right now is pointed directly at the Sun so it's pretty sharp it was getting out 60 watts as soon as I turned on the east-west tracker which is that way, of course, that way's north and that way south. It went from 60 watts to 70 watts, just by being perpendicular to the sun. And as soon as I tipped it from horizontal to this, about a 80 degree angle towards the sun, which is that way, of course, it went from 70 watts to 120 watts so pointing the panel from flat to perpendicular to the Sun literally doubled its output in just two minutes so what what's the big point of all this if your space can limited a dual axis tracker can easily double the output of your panel at this time of year no this is not a cheaper way to do it. This is very expensive. There's no economic reason to do it anymore. Because if I want to double the output, you just get another panel. This particular panel was $34.99 on eBay. Yeah, $34.99. And it's a 260 what is it? Uh, 270 watt panel. 270. If you get perfect sun. That's magnificent. The 72 panel. 72 cell panel. Uh, used to be on the grid somewhere. Making utility power. Probably out in Arizona. Well anyway. There you go.